Admiring your own handiwork is a familiar expression containing an important truth about the mind. We handed this particular story to our Tony DeCopel. Are you the kind of person who actually likes washing dishes? How about folding laundry? Yard work? Really? What all these have in common, of course, is they occupy our hands. And as it turns out, some researchers think that may be key to making our brains very happy. I made up this term called behavior pseudicals instead of pharmaceuticals in the sense that when we move and when we engage in, in activities, we change the neurochemistry of our brain in ways that a, a drug can change the neurochemistry of our brain. Kelly Lambert is a neuroscientist at the University of Richmond who says our brains have evolved to reward us for getting a grip on the world, which is why... In the 19th century, doctors used to prescribe knitting to women who were overwrought with anxiety because they sensed that it calmed them down some. And it sounds, oh, that's simplistic, but when you think about, okay, repetitive movement is increasing certain neurochemicals, and then if you produce something, a hat, a hat or a scarf, there's the reward. Of course, working with your hands is not always easy. Just ask Matthew Crawford, a part-time mechanic from Richmond, Virginia. Uh, there's literally blood on the table <laughs> yeah. right now from early. The, the, yeah, there usually is, yeah. Crawford prefers some nicks and cuts to what he used to do as executive director of a think tank in Washington, D.C. Did your hands look like that? Uh, probably not, no. Uh, they were pretty clean. Uh, but I was, you know, I was always sleepy. I just, there was no amount of coffee that could, that could keep me awake. In the garage, using his hands, Crawford finds that his mind goes into high gear. And there are times when I crack some nut that way, we're all like run over and kick the garbage can just out of elation. It was such a revelation, he wrote a best-selling book on the subject. Hot, hot, hot. Which taps into the same attraction that makes reality shows like Forged in Fire, Top Chef, and Project Runway so popular. And then you use one color with it yeah. all throughout. They all glorify handiwork. If you're making something and painting or cooking and putting things together and you're using both hands in a little bit more creative way, ways, that's going to be more engaging for the brain. It's something a lot of us crave, especially now, as fewer of us do much at all with our hands. As of 2015, jobs requiring social and analytical skills, desk jobs, had increased 94% from 1980, while jobs requiring physical skills went up a mere 12%. And that has Kelly Lambert concerned. We just sit there and we press buttons and you... You start to lose a sense of control over your environment. She's Able been using calls. rodents to study the hand-brain connection. Lambert says that rats made to dig for a reward showed greater signs of mental health when compared to what she calls her trust fund rats, who got a pass on doing any physical work. So when we took an animal that was really in tune with the environment and we just gave them their rewards without having to work for them, their stress hormones went up high. They lost all of their benefits. Wow. So you know, we've turned thing. ourselves into trust fund rats, is what you're saying. I'm scared we are, yes. Few of us are as in touch with our hands as Zaria Foreman. In her Brooklyn studio, she creates stunningly realistic portraits of icebergs, all with the tips of her fingers. I always just started using my hands from an early age, and I think there's something very personal about feeling the pigment myself with my hands and moving it around and and in a way that imbues a part of me as the artist like into each piece that I make. Do you want to try? Yes, I do. Okay. okay. And while what I made wasn't much more than a smudge, now just move Blend. it around. Yeah, move it around. What I felt while doing it was something Feel my hand, brain palm, surely appreciated. This is amazing. <laughs> I actually love this. <laughs> oh, my God.